Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how you can turn on your screen recording settings on the iPad. So here's the iPad. What you need to do first of all is swipe down and this is your control center. What you're looking for is this button here. This is the screen recording app. So I'm going to show you how you can add this now and then we come back to this screen. So you need to open up settings and then you need to scroll down to control center as you can see here. Then you're going to tap on customize controls. And then if you scroll down now, these are all the controls that you can add to the control center. And at the bottom here, you'll see one that says screen recording. So you tap that plus, and now you can see it's included in your control center. So let's come out and now we can swipe down. And now you can see that the screen recording icon is there. Now to use screen recording, what you first need to do is turn on the microphone because by default, the microphone is turned off. So if we tap and hold, now we can see this menu here and now we can turn on the microphone and the microphone is now ready to go. So to start the recording, you click on start recording. It's going to count you down three, two, one. Then the recording has now started, okay? So we can tell the recording is going because if we go back to our screen, up in the corner here, you'll see a red icon. That means your screen is now recording. Now whatever's happening on the screen will be recorded. So to stop the recording, you tap on that red button, you then tap on stop, and then you'll get a message saying that that screen recording, as you can see, is now saved into your photos. So you can go to your Photos app by tapping on Photos, and there you can see our screen recording. To play the screen recording, just tap, and then it will play. That is the screen recording we recorded earlier on. So what I'm gonna show you now is how you can screen record a presentation that you may have created on Google Slides or Keynotes, or using PowerPoint. So let's come out of this by pressing the home button. Now I'm going to go into Google Slides. There is Google Slides and I've got a presentation ready to go. So what I'm going to first of all do is start my screen recording. So I'm going to scroll down and press the button, make sure that my microphone is on and then start the recording. Now you can see that the recording has started. So let's now come back to the screen. Now I want to record my whole presentation. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press the play button and I'm gonna present on this device. And there you can see my presentation has started. And then what you do is then you record your presentation. This is a quick tutorial on how to add the screen recording tool to your control center. To access the control center, you swipe down. Speak through your slides one by one as if you were presenting in class. Tell the students to pause at different points so they can complete a task that you give them. So once you've finished the recording, you can press the home button swipe down or press the red button in the corner and stop your recording. Now what you might want to do now is trim down your video so you lose those recorded bits at the beginning where you're pressing the record button and at the end. So what we can do is we can go into photos, let's click on the piece and then we tap on where it says edit in the corner. All right, so now let's edit my recording. So I'm going to drag my recording here until my video actually starts. OK, so so there it is. That's where it starts. And then I can drag the end to where it stops. And then I can click done. Now what I've done is I've trimmed the beginning and the end of the video to make it more precise. So the final part of this now is to get that video recording into your Google Classroom. So what you would do is you go into your Google Classroom, tap on the classroom that you want to send this to, go to Classwork, and then 
add it as an assignment or a material, whichever you want. So I'm going to add it as an assignment. And then I'm going to put in here. Okay, so that's the title of my assignment. I'm just going to give it a topic of training, save, and then I'm going to add my screen recording. Now to do that, what you need to do is tap on the paper clip and then go to pick photo, then find the screen recording that you've just recorded. So I'm going to tap on this one. That's my screen recording. Press use. That's going to compress the file, as you can see here. So it may take a little bit of time, depending on how long your video is. Now, once the video is in your assignment, it may take a bit of time to process. So your students may not necessarily be able to watch it right away. So be aware of that because sometimes it takes a bit of time to process in Google Drive. Then what you do, you assign it. So I'm gonna tap on assign and then the students will have access to that video. So I'm gonna log on now as a student to show you what they see. So this is my student view. So let's tap in the classroom. New assignment, record your own screen recording on your iPad. We can go to classwork. We should be able to see that under our training. There it is, record your own screen recording. Let's tap on that, tap on the video, and then that video will play. This is a quick tutorial on how to add the screen. So that is how you create a screen recording and then upload that screen recording to Google Classroom. Thanks for watching. Please click the like button and please subscribe to this channel for more educational technology videos. Until next time, goodbye.